The Forgivery time was a very interesting time. It began 570 million years back. It covered 88-90% of Earth's history. The very first animals evolved in the Precambrian era. In the Precambrian time, the earliest known animals were formed. They were peculiar yet interesting animals. They are not your everyday animals you would see in your local zoo. Imagine your average feather being a living and breathing animal. This is a chirodiscus. A Picanaria resembles a ribbed doormat. There are three types of animals categorized in the Precambrian times. The first is sponges. They lack organs and nerves. The second is chindarius, which is mostly jellyfish with simple digestive systems. The last is annelids, which are mostly types of worms. Cambrian time started when Earth formed 4.5 billion years ago. In the beginning, Earth was molten and sometime in its first 800 million years, it eventually turned into a solid. The atmosphere was made out of methane, ammonia, and other toxic gases. Around 2.5 billion years ago, oxygen was formed. The oldest rock from this time is from 3.8 billion years ago. In the late Precambrian times, stable continents formed. One major event that happened 4.5 billion years ago was the formation of the moon. It was formed when a Mars-sized object crashed into Earth, sending a large amount of debris into space which collapsed into the moon. Although the Precambrian contains some seven-eighths of Earth's history, its fossil record is very poor, with the majority of fossils being stramulites that are often heavily metamorphosed or deeply buried. However, a few preserved fossils have been discovered. Fossil hunter Rolf Harris came across a weird-looking smudge in 650 million-year-old shales in the Hyphulgia region of southern China. He was easily convinced that he had found something very unusual. A high-resolution scale later, they found that it was probably one of the most unique Precambrian fossils ever discovered. This specimen appears to be possessing something like a head with curious floppy projections on either side. The slightly lighter pit could even be some form of primitive eyes. A bulky body is somewhat lacking in internal details, but there are some suggestions of numerous small carotinous projections of unknown functioning. Overall, the Precambrian time was one of the most interesting times. This time, was when the earth was born and life began. If the Precambrian time hadn't existed, then neither would we. Thank you for enjoying our video. See you next time. Bye.